hello my lovies welcome to my youtube channel uh today we're just gonna be going through my vanity to show you the things that i use for my face and for my body so we're gonna start with the micellar cleaning gel jelly this one i use to remove uh, my makeup and it's quite reasonable actually but i can't remember the price so whenever i find the prices i'll link them down below okay and the second thing that I use for my for removing my makeup, well, this one is MAC. This one is MAC, right? MAC oil for removing my makeup. This one is quite pricey, right? Um, I cringed when I bought it. I think it was 600 and something or 700 rand. Too expensive for something to remove your makeup. Okay so there's a couple of face washes that i use depending on my mood or depending on the problem i have on my skin at that particular day or month uh, so i use a couple of things for my face so i'm gonna show you a whole lot of things um but they do the trick believe in me so we're gonna start with my face wash the face wash that i use for sensitive skin is this eucerine eucerine one this is for sensitive skin and i find that it works actually hey um it doesn't age it doesn't sting so i love this uh uh eucerine demaclean it's got hyaluron um and it says it's for sensitive skin and the second thing that i like using it's a spot control from neutrogena this one it works nice for my spots I mean, it does say it's for spot controlling, as you can see. I used to suffer a lot from very stubborn spots, but of late, I, I don't struggle from that. I don't know why. Maybe it's aging. I don't know. Okay. And another face wash. It's from Elizabeth Adam. This one uh, is from the Range Ceramide Replenishing Cleansing Oil so it goes it goes along with my um night cream and my day cream so even this one it's a it's a bit pricey so i really really uh don't use it just you know for yeah i use it special special because it's very expensive okay so now that i'm done with my face wash and all that i'm gonna go through the scrubs that i use so first of all i love the scrub i always gravitate uh, uh gravitate towards it because it's very reasonable in price i think this goes for i think 99 rand i'm not sure but i'll link the prices down below but that's a good scrub it i i, I find that it helps me with uh um unplugging my 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 pores and and I clogs my pores and all that, so this is very good. And then another scrub that I like, it's this one from Roy Boss. Um, all these things, guys, I've tried and tested them. <laughs> they work, they work wonders. So this one, it refines the pores and smooth uh, smooths the skin. So it's got a bioactive rebus and an apricot kernel. So it's also quite good. It's not itchy, does not sting. So it's one of those safe scrubs that one can use. So it's also very reasonable compared to a, a lot of high end um, scrubs, you know. Um, this is a set that I once got from, from Body Shop. It's two of them. Uh, as you can see okay this one it says the glow revealing liquid peel this one um i use it maybe after a month or two because it works to sort of like um give the skin a new feel sort of like it's also, it works like a peel sort of and this also is like my ma micro abrasion it's also like similar to scrub but it 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 sort of like awakens your skin and it rejuvenates it. Um, it also takes away the dead skin cells. So this one works wonders as well. 
I've got a lot of skin stuff, guys. Like, it's not even funny. Like, okay. I've got my body oil that I use on a daily basis. Um, no need to go through this a lot. It's Nivea. It's, 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 it's wonderful. It works for my stretch marks, for any dark spots that I find them difficult to remove. This does wonders. Okay. Now we are moving along. Oh, by the way, I love this shower gel from Woolies. Smells great. Um, I think this is my second bottle that I go through. I once bought it a long time ago. And when I went to Woolies, I saw it again. So I took the, the bottle. It's, it smells nice. I'm not sure of the price though. But yes. And for all on, I use my lovely Nivea. Nivea, Nivea again. Yeah, this is my go-to go uh, for my um, armpits and all that. So we're going to go now to my my creams for night, for day, and so forth. And I think, yeah, so this one, it's an, remember I showed you the Elizabeth Adden face wash. It's a ceramide uh, uh, range. So, I use also the day cream, the day cream from Elizabeth Aden. And I've been using it for quite some time now. And I find that it treats my skin very well. And I find that my skin is still feeling like, you know, young and all that. And it's smooth and it's fresh all the time. So, that works wonders. So, this is the day cream. And I've got the night cream. The lids are not the same. As you can see, this one is a bit lighter in gold. This one is a bit darker. So this one is for night, obviously. So it's still the ceramide range. So this is a night cream. It lifts and firms. Yeah, now, now I know why my face looks like this. Because it lifts and firms. And my skin really does feel a bit nice and firm. And I'm aging, guys. I gotta look after that skin, okay? So, what I find that that it also helps with my skin is these two oils. So, uh, before I apply my night cream or my day cream, this is what I use. It's Skin Functional. The Skin Functional Oil, right? The skin functional is specifically for dark marks. It's got two alpha or butene and, and plus hyper hyper bright. So what I struggle from is hyperpigmentation. Um I think I was once told that it's because of hormonal issues. It's a couple of things that um contribute towards it. So yes, I do go for my skin peels. But remember, I also need to look after my skin in terms of uh, other things. So I find that this skin functional, this baby here, works wonders. So I apply this before I apply my um, morning um, day cream. And then I've got Kiehl's. Kiehl's, uh, I bought this at Edgar's. Um, kills. I know I'm sure it's a bit faint you can't see it but it's it's written clearly corrective dark spot solution so this once I wash my face at night I, I apply it so I had to like give them a bit of space in between because as you can see I've got two different oils but this one I've chosen to use it in the morning before my day cream and this one is for the evening before my night cream so the last thing that I want to show you is something that I just recently... Oh, sorry. I forgot to show you my sunscreen. My go-to sunscreen. As you can hear, um, it's getting finished. So, but I did manage to get another one. And this one, the reason I love this La Roche-Posay, um, particularly the, the sunscreen, is I find that a lot of sunscreen... They sting your eyes and they make your eyes feel funny, you know. 
so this one doesn't sting your eyes uh, you can apply it anytime and you, you you'll not get that puffiness on your eyes and you it will not sting your eyes so hence I I had to stick to this little baby it's a bit costly but it takes it, it, it takes a while before it finishes it takes a while hey so yeah this one go for it and then lastly i want to show you something that i just recently got i can't remember where i got this guys from this cam or oh, i can't remember to be quite honest but let me tell you this body cream this body cream i know it looks like vaseline to you but let me tell you it's not even close to vaseline or it's not even close to that texture of vaseline because sometimes some people do like Vaseline and some people don't like that oiliness, you know. But this one, it's more like, a, I don't know how to describe the substance, the, the, the consistency of it. But this, it's, a, it's, it's, it's got some sheer butter. They call it the body butter pot. Bubble Up. The brand is Bubble Up. I love this. I love this let me tell you i love this and the sad part is i don't know where i bought this from <laughs> oh, oh, is that possible guys oh gosh i'm gonna have to go hunt i'm gonna have to go hunt as soon as this baby gets finished but you know i still have a long way but you you understand what i'm saying you get me you get me you get me i'm gonna have to go hunt for this baby so yeah so that's about it for me i could have missed some things but anyway i'm still here i'm gonna still bring you some dope content so please like comment and subscribe see you in my next video